What's up, YouTube? It's your BFFs. Y'all know it's Tuesdays. And when I say Tuesday, I'm saying dates with D-A-T-E-S because this is me and Bae's little date day. And we decided we're going to start doing a Q&A for y'all whenever we go out on our little dates. Because I feel like I always promise y'all a Q&A, then we get too busy and don't actually do it. So, so far this morning, I've already posted on my IG story. So, make sure y'all following me and him on Instagram. Here's the little names right here. And um, I already posted on my story asking like, what it is y'all want to know. Do your worst. And y'all that already started flooding and I went back to I made a community post on YouTube like a, a week or so, a few weeks ago actually, saying that I do a QA and a and I promise when I first posted it, it was like five questions. I went back and checked it today, it was like 81 questions. So we're gonna try our hardest to answer as many questions as we can for y'all. But it is a lot of repeat questions on there. Like everybody wanna know, are we having babies? Yes, we are going to have babies sometime in the future when the good Lord determines it's time for us to have a baby. Right now we have a baby. Her name is baby girl, she's eight years old and that's all we need, that's all we can handle and that's okay. On Tuesdays, I figured because it was Tuesday, we would do Taco Tuesdays, but babe, what you wanted for lunch? Oh, you know, I got to hit my ass hot dogs, you feel me? I don't know nothing about that ass hot dogs. Y'all, he been eating hot city. dogs. Y'all been eating glizzies, bro. Don't shoot me, bro. Don't That's all he been eating for how long? How long you been on this hot dog kick? I don't know, bro. Don't, don't talk about me. Yeah, he been. He said it make you feel it. like he's still. Shut up. <laughs> he said he make you feel like he's still what in BBS or something. Or he back in school. He just missed the church hot dog, y'all. So that's all he been eating. Chili cheese hot dog go crazy though. You can't beat him. It, it's Perfect good, lunch. it's good, it's good. But I'm telling y'all right now, them hot dogs, you can buy a pack of weenies. He like the red kind too. So for $2, you can buy a pack of weenies. For a dollar, you can go get a pack of buns. For 57 cents, we can go get a can of chili. For 37 cents, we can go get some cheese. Mm -mm. It's not gonna be the same. And we can make them ourselves at home. It's not gonna be the His same. hot dogs is $6 a dog, y'all. And it's a regular little size hot dog. Y'all gonna see it. I thought we were gonna get tacos. He want a hot dog. We didn't eat that a couple of times. I always get the red beans and rice. I always get the trio. It's a red beans and rice with some sausage, with some chicken and shrimp gumbo and some shrimp etouffee. But I think I'm like over that right now. It's 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 a regular day. It's not the winner. I don't need to be eating that. So I think I want to get a burger today. Cause they hot dogs are good. So I'm wondering if they burgers taste good. You think it's gonna be good? I hope so. I hope so. We finna go get us something to eat and then we'll sit down and chit chat with y'all and get through this little Q&A together. Y'all, this food smells so good right now. Like, I wish, ooh, baby, this smells I so good. I told y'all about that ass hot dog. I don't yeah, know if it's your hot dog. I told y'all about that ass hot dog. Yeah. Mm. Every time. Every time. Baby, I don't know if it's his Every hot time. dog or my burger. And I said I was going, what I said I was going to get? I was going to go to, to a Smoothie King and give me a little acai bowl. And instead, he got, what did you get, babe? You got... Four chili cheese, cheese hot dogs with nothing else, just chili and cheese. Normally he get jalapenos. He ain't want that this time. And I got um a hamburger. Oh, you want what you ready to eat now? Or did you want to go home and eat? Oh, we can go home. You want to go home? You want to go home? Yeah, yeah okay. let's go home. All right, we finna go home and eat and answer the questions for y'all. So we'll see y'all when we get there. How are we back at home, y'all? I'm finna wrap up my little hair because this is my first time getting a lace and I am terrified of messing it up. So while I do that, babe, finna show y'all what it is that we got to eat today. All right, so I ain't gonna lie. Y'all always see her bite my shit, you feel me? So today, I'm gonna bite her shit, you feel me? Normally, the reason why y'all don't see me ever biting her shit, she always gets stuff that she know I wouldn't eat on my stuff. And I think she be doing it on purpose, just to make sure I don't bite it. But see, all the stuff I get, you, you gonna wanna bite it, cause it's good. It's gonna be good to every tongue, you feel me? Her stuff be limited to only a few tongues, you feel me? All everything she be eating on. But sometimes she do, she do have a good bitch. I can't even, you know what I'm saying? I can't lie. Sometimes she have a good bitch. But see, this here is ass hot dogs. It's all I mean. So, as you can see, as I'm reaching out this bag, I've grabbed out four, count them, four hot dogs. So I got me some chili cheese hot dogs, you feel me? 
can't go wrong with the basic. Yeah, you feed me, get it, you know what I'm saying? Can't go wrong with that. Make you feel like you got a baseball game, football game, basketball game. Yeah, vacation Bible school, you feel me? <laughs> so first, I want to see what type of burger she got. She got, I think it's a double cheeseburger. It might just be a cheeseburger, but mm, a little messy. See, I ain't gonna lie. This is what I be talking about. This is what I be talking about. I wouldn't put all this on my burger, y'all. You hear me? I would never put all this on my burger. So, I'm gonna have to, I don't know, bro. I'm gonna have to find the least filthy part of the burger and bite it. Y'all be fingering my food because you don't like it. Let me see my burger. Is it good? Mm. Mm. Okay, let me see. Let me see. You just got too so much stuff good. on it. Hold on. Mm. Did you tell them what I got on my burger, y'all? I got lettuce, tomatoes, mayo, ketchup, grilled peppers, girl, onions. I'm supposed to be in a salad right now. I feel like this is meat in, in a salad. This is salad on bread. And she you also got, salad? and she also got. Croutons. Croutons? For my salad. What you mean <laughs> croutons? Were well, you saying croutons because of that? No, they croutons. This is like croutons and this is a salad on toast. I thought she was trying to read craw taters because it says craw taters. Mm -hmm. But she got the zaps chips, you feel me? No, we're not getting no check for this. But hey, zaps, holla at me, you feel me? We getting the zaps. Mm. Spicy Cajun craw taters. I love crawfish, so I feel like some spicy crawfish flavored chips should hit. You feel me? Should hit. So you made a good choice with these chips, I feel like. You know me, I can't go wrong with the classic, you hear me? You give me a regular late chip, you gotta eat more than one, you hear me? I hate that him and baby girl love these chips. Where is the flavor? If I'm gonna eat these, I need hot sauce. That's or real dip. flavor though. That's real flavor. I need hot sauce and dip if I'm gonna eat those. That's real flavor. Mm. We're gonna do this bite, you feel me? Let's hot cheers. Let it hot dog, you feel me? Cheers. Bye -bye. Hey, but don't smoke me for eating my glizzy, no diddy. Mm. Mm. I love chips. Mm. Let me scoop your little chili and cheese with this chip. Hold on. This food is so good. Maybe know. we just hungry. I think I'm hungry. We've been all day. We've been gone all morning, y'all. We've been out all day and stuff. So We've been be. working on Sadie. Might be. No. Mm. That cheese is good. I told you. That's what said it all. If we can figure out what kind of cheese is good, we're going to make this at home. I don't know what type of cheese, because the cheese that come in the can don't be hidden like that. You know what I'm talking about? Mm. Not the cheese they sell in the can and everything like at Walmart. It don't be hidden like this. Y'all look at how nasty and good this burger looks back there. Mm. It looks so good. Okay, I'm gonna take one more bite and I'm gonna be done because I'm already in gas. There you go. Mmm. Mmm. This pepper and onion is good, baby. Did you buy pepper and onion too? That's it. That's it. You don't even taste the onion. He don't like onion, y'all. He be mad about onion from some hill. I be getting food here. Like, I heard you back there. I'm talking about getting food you don't really like. Because <laughs> you be putting so much stuff on your food. I'm finna go find the iPad so we can answer some mm. questions. Uh, do you want to eat? How do you want to answer questions? I don't know how to do it. Mm -hmm. Hold on. Let me charge my phone. Oh, no, you need to charge your you phone. Charge oh, I need to charge my phone. Let us go find someone to sit down and answer these questions for y'all. Y'all, we finally finna get this little Q&A started. We get so tired. We done been at the car lot. We finna get ready to go back to the car lot. We gotta go pick a baby girl. I gotta get her a little snack put together. I just got done filming videos for TikTok. We tired. So, but we finna get into these questions with y'all. Now, the thing I noticed about these questions, I did a Q&A by myself. I'm finna, can I put my feet in I did a Q&A on my own about a month or so ago. So I don't know how to ask these questions for myself, so I'm gonna let you guys most of them. Okay. Okay, so let's see. I'm trying to scroll through the crazy ones. I should have planned out what we was gonna ask. Okay, somebody asked, relationship advice for maintaining a happy home slash long-term relationship. What's, what, what do you think makes us work, basically? Oh, that's easy. We really like each other. <laughs> True. I mean, I don't, I don't, it's that simple. I mean, like when you really love somebody or you really like enjoy the person that you with, things are kind of just gonna flow. Like I don't know. Like when, me and her don't really have too many arguments. We've had spats. Every relationship has arguments. Like it's not gonna be. It's no relationship out here where you can't ever just agree on everything. It's gonna be times that y'all disagree with one another on things, but. For the most part, we always just talk through it and we get through it. It's never. It's In never the most annoying way, problem we have the least amount 
a relationship problem between the two of us. Like when we have issues, it's we have issues with something else together. It's never me and him have yeah. an issue with each other. Like yeah. we, we know we're on the same team with everything. Yeah. Okay, people want to know how we met. I've answered that before. So how would you tell the story of how we met? Uh, okay, so first of all, I met her my freshman year of high school down here. Yeah, um, how we met? I'm trying to really remember. Cause I just I know it was my freshman year. I know. Uh, I, still I don't know. Get, I know. Khadija introduced us. Yeah, I still don't get how he even liked me when I met him. I was trying to hook him up with a friend. I don't know she how. Wasn't bad, she wasn't even messing with me. She tried, uh, she tried to slip me out. No, I wasn't. I heard you was funny. My friend kept talking. Well, I heard you was funny. I did. I like funny guys. It's, I was trying to hook him up with somebody else. I don't know how we got. You like funny guys, guys, so you wanted me to talk to somebody else. I didn't know you. I didn't know you. Y'all I think he literally just said, "Will you be my girlfriend?" I'm like, "Yeah, sure." Yeah, I'm pretty sure it was something along the lines of that. I was young, ugly, and stupid, so it was probably. I was young, ugly, and stupid. We were both was, young, ugly, and ugly. <laughs> they want to know what baby girl calls me. She calls me princess. Yeah, she yeah she calls her princess. How in the morning when she in the morning when we still sleep, let it like she don't say daddy she. Princess! Yeah, yeah, she, Boy, she it's the worst me. alarm clock in yeah, the yeah. world. Boy. I'm talking about first thing in the morning. Daddy! Y'all think that good morning shit bad. <laughs> Y'all don't want to kill her in the morning. I'm talking about as soon as the sun come up. Daddy, I'm hungry. I'm talking about first thing in the Somebody morning. Somebody asks, what makes us want to do social media? Um, for one, for one, she loves this. Like she, this has been something that she has been wanting to dive into. For me, it kind of just happened. <laughs> you feel me? But uh -huh. I do enjoy it. I do enjoy. Uh, I do enjoy our audience because yeah, we just us. Like we, we y'all didn't meet us doing no crazy stuff or nothing like that. We just us. It's always positive. We ain't never trying to put nothing negative out. We, you know what I'm saying? So. I like it. I like this side of social media. I know there are other sides of social media where it's just filled with like nothing but drama and and trolling and negative comments. And of course, the all CII does see some of the negative and trolling comments, but it's never enough to even and even if it wasn't right, it's just I mean, y'all y'all see what's going on. You know what I'm saying? So yeah, all in all, I like it. And guess what? I'm sorry. Shoot me. It's better than having to go to a job. Like this, I like this job. Like this probably. I love this job. Like I can't lie, I like this job. I like this job. Hey, hey, I like this job. How do you feel about me calling her London baby girl all the time? It's fine with me. I don't even know how I started that for real. Like I don't even know. Yeah, I don't know. And God of shit, I can't remember not ever calling her that. Yeah. I don't even know how I got started. I just don't know. Do you want more children? Yes, I do. I do. How many more? With her. Huh? How many more? It's a toss up between one to two. Yeah, I don't know. It's hard to decide. It's like, I want one because I just feel like it'd be easy to throw all out all into that one child. And then it's like, I want two because when me and him teaming up against the baby, I don't want the baby to feel alone. Like, the baby need a partner. If me and you getting on the baby nerve and the baby like, I need somebody to talk to. They need a friend. Sorry, it's going to be dealing against us. <laughs> I don't want the baby yeah, to feel like that. <laughs> let me, she her own soldier. <laughs> she can handle it. But I feel like our baby going to be like, man, mama, dad, you know, my nerve, what is you about to talk to? So we got to have two children. I asked, do we ever want a pet? She was just talking the other day, talking about she wanted a baby Dalmatian. I do. I don't know. Why. Not no hey, for the record, y'all, I am not, I'm not a dog friend, I was a dog fan. Now, if I had to have a pet, I would want a cat. I feel like cats are chill. I'm talking about one of them chill cats. Now, I know one of them crazy cats that scratch up and pee all over the place and all that. Because all cats don't do that now. There are some good domesticated cats that you can get that literally would just chill and sit in your lap. But all they day. can climb on top of cabinets and fridges. That's I fine. Want, I don't want that. I, ain't I, I would mind coming in the kitchen and, and see a cat sitting on top of my fridge. And seeing Paul sitting on top of the fridge. That's a love the food. Hey, look, I ain't tripping. Imagine the cat sitting next to the cereal box right now. I'd rather that than the dog around here barking and shitting all over the place, <laughs> bro. Like, so. Okay, next question. We're going to revisit that one. <laughs> next question is, um, dang, I just said, 
Who fell in love first? I do not know. I'm gonna say, I'm gonna say I did, but I no, listen, I'm gonna say I did, but I feel like she probably did, but she ain't gonna say she did before me. No, I, I ain't got no problem. I, ain't I got no literally problem. said I love you first. But I'm saying though. I literally said I love you first. So how you gonna say I wouldn't say it? I'm saying I though. I said it first. But I'm saying though. What do you mean? Okay, so we you think you fell in love with? Me? Who fell in love with me? Who fell in love with you the moment I said it? And I spoke on it the second it happened. I ain't wait. I spoke on it the second I felt it. I said it. Who fell in love with me? 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 Who fell in love all right, now, fellas, for the yeah. fellas that are watching, you are, you are, you are not tuned in to your first it's Cash's Corner, you feel me? This is the first This is the first moment that you're getting to see me put in a corner, you feel me? And let me show you how I get out of this corner. <laughs> what? I fell in love with you when I, uh, when I saw you in ninth grade, baby. Shut up! Shut up! No, move, move! What he's not going to tell y'all <laughs> is that he broke up with me in ninth grade. I don't know what she's talking about. He broke up with me in ninth grade. I don't know what she's talking about. I don't know what she's talking about. Somebody asks, what's your favorite meal that I make you? I ain't gonna lie. <laughs> <laughs> what, bro? What? What you, what you mean at? No, in my head, I'm figuring, this is banquets. <laughs> I was very <laughs> That's all I'm saying in my head. Y'all, yeah, you want me telling what your favorite meals that you request? Cause if I tell y'all his top request meals, then y'all gonna hey, I ain't gonna hold you. Hey look, look, hey look, ain't no, hey look, ain't no mystery in my history. <laughs> I, I ain't got no problem with look. I mean, now listen, this this is my go-to. I'ma answer, I'ma answer what I like her to cook, but this is my go-to. Like, I ain't gonna hold you. You give me some banquet sauce big steaks, bro. Some mashed potatoes and gravy. And, and some uh, and some macaroni or some corn or something, you know what I'm saying? A dinner roll. Tell me your other favorite meat besides that banquet. You feel me? He loves red weenies. Red weenies and mac and Hold on, um, bro. Relax, bro. banquet Hold on. and mashed potatoes. <laughs> relax, bro. Relax. Yeah, this is two favorite <laughs> meals. Y'all wonder why I'll microwave everything over here. No, no, no. That's not, that's not, I'm going to say they're my favorite meals. Those are just quick, easy little cheap little go-to meal that I like to, you know what I'm saying, from home, you know, and if I don't want to eat out, you feel me, I just throw, you know, a, a, a little bit of that processed garbage in there real quick and go ahead and tear it up real quick, but uh, my favorite thing, to be honest, that you cook for me what? is that um dish, the chicken brine pasta that you did for Carl. That, so I don't know, I don't know. So hey look, hey look, look, hey look, let me know in the comments if y'all mess with Carabas. That's one of my favorite uh like Italian places to eat at, but I do mess with Carabas heavy. But the chicken brine, that's the dish that she uh replicated from there. And she, when I say she good. she made it to like it tastes exactly the same. Like when it's I say good. it tastes exactly how it tastes at Carabas bar, it tastes exactly like she got every ingredient down to it type like perfect, you know what I'm saying? So, yeah, that's part of the chicken brine. That's my favorite. That's my favorite dish. Okay, we're going to do just two more questions, y'all, because we actually do have an appointment we got to get to. And shout out to Funny Leave on Instagram. I don't know who you is, but you might as well come here and sit down and interview us. You got the best questions. Two questions, babe. The first one going to be, were you nervous me my family for the first time, or was it just a natural click? Oh, no. Nah, it, it was a natural click, because I naturally clicked with, like, like with everybody, I ain't gonna lie. Like I'm very, I'm very likable. My family um, love anybody. <laughs> yeah, I'm family friendly, so it, it just worked out. I was friendly, they were friendly. We I'm talking friendly. about as soon as he came in, they didn't know he was coming in because he was with me. They thought he was friends with my sister boyfriend, so they thought my sister boyfriend was just bringing his friend over. And then all of a sudden, I walk over there and I'm like, "Mom, this is my friend John," and he's just, "Hey, how you doing?" Just smile, smile. Show him how you smile. Show him the dimples, baby. That's how, that's how you did it. Okay, good. final okay. question. I feel like I want to go first. Is it, Okay, the question is, what do y'all like about each other the most? Who should go first? Because I feel like I want to go first because I feel like your answer might be better than mine. You so far. And I don't want to have to follow that up. So I just really get my trash answer out the way. I say this all the time. The thing I like the most about him is how much he adores me. Like, you have an obsession with me, and I love that for us, baby. Like, I can do no wrong to him, and that is just, having 
finding somebody that make you feel good about absolutely everything you do is just not normal, I don't think. Like, I don't feel like everybody has that. Like, you always make me feel good. You make me feel like I can't do no wrong. Even when I'm in the wrong and I know I'm wrong and I know he know that I know that I'm wrong, he'll still, all right, baby, it's okay. You, you got me, baby. It's fine. And I love that. Like, I appreciate this. Don't look at me. Sorry, you're making me nervous. I appreciate that so much. Basically she said she liked that I kiss her ass. <laughs> no, does that sound like a bad ass? <laughs> no, no. He made me feel good, y'all. I like that. What? Okay, what do you like about me? Okay, I ain't gonna lie. Immediately when me and her started talking, like, I instantly clicked with her personality. Like, her personality speaks so many volumes to me. It is just who she is as a person. Like, I... I Y'all have me teary eyed on this couch. Mm, right? I just go don't be saying your wedding But yeah, though, yeah, y'all gonna make me start ranting. You know what I'm saying? But nah, it, her, her personality. Of course, she's beautiful. Of course, she's vibrant. She's so caring. The way she gravitated to my daughter, bro, it's instantaneously. Like I don't know what I'm saying this. It's a lot of stuff. It's more than one thing. So that, that question is really hard for me because yeah, I could put so pressure. I could put so many I could put so many balls in that basket. <laughs> Shut up. And I do love watching him be a dad. I grew up with an amazing daddy. So all I know is what a good father is. I don't know what it's like to not have a good daddy. I don't know what it's like to not have a daddy that's not around. All I know is what a good father should be. And he is that. Like, he really is. From the moment I first met him, like, he was a little skeptical on letting me meet his baby so early. I think I was asking to meet up before you was ready to bring me around. Is that not true? No, you it ain't even that. First. No, it ain't even that necessarily. It's more so like, cause you didn't have no children, so it's kind of like, dog, like, like uh, yeah, okay. It's just kind of like, come on, think about it. It's kind of like how, kind of like how people, like how they talk on social media about men going to find women that got multiple kids or yeah. type thing. It kind of felt like that. I'm like, it probably feel, it probably would be worse because I'm the dude, I'm the one. You feel me? I, I don't even mind. I like kids, though. And literally the day we met, I think the first day we walked out, I was leaving the house to go somewhere, and she was like, can I ride with you? So it literally, it was just, it was natural. Yeah. So but he London had no reason it. to be nervous. Yeah. London loves it. London loves it. I love it. You love it. We love it. It's all good. We're going to go ahead and end this right here. Something I wanted to do was do another video with baby girl later on, but I feel like this one is kind of dragging out. So we're going to go ahead and end this one now. Did you enjoy being with them today, baby? Yes, I did. Yes, I did. Yes, I did. You think we can do, um, I'm going to call these PB&J Q&A twos dates. <laughs> do you like Sheesh. Do you like that? You don't think it we'll work on the name. We'll work on the we'll name. We'll work on the name. We will we'll see you guys in the next vlog. Bye.